Scott Morris. Yeah. Huh. That's uh, what they call me. Oh, sorry. Oh, that's okay. Um, you ready? Oh my gosh, welcome back to DBL. One of our favorite 90210 alums is back on TV spreading some cheer in her new movie, A Kind Hearted Christmas. Plus, she's going to spill all the tea on her weekly podcast with Bestie Tori Spelling, and we definitely cannot get enough. I've been listening. Welcome to DBL, Jenny Gall. Yeah. yeah. Hey. Hi. Come on. Hello. Okay, so first and foremost, on your, oh, I heard a dog in the background. Oh, do you, detective? Bring your dog in. Bring your dog in. It's a little crazy. That's okay. Your dog's welcome on camera. We love the pooches here. So on your podcast, 90210, stop it, Jeff. On your podcast, 90210, uh, OMG, you guys share some behind-the-scenes drama. Tell us something crazy that happened when the cameras stopped rolling. Ooh. Oh, geez, there's so, I mean, every episode, we're watching the whole show from the very beginning, one episode at a time, and I've never done that before. But uh, every episode, we'll just like strike up some memory of some crazy shenanigans that happened. So <laughs> I have to watch the episode to like narrow it in for you. <laughs> So tune into the podcast because yes. they give all the deets. Yes. And I got to say, the name 9021OMG mm -hmm. is just such a seal of approval from this punster <laughs> here. Just a wonderful name. Uh, I do, we, I'm glad you like it. I do. Uh, we want to play a little high school superlative game about your 90210 castmates. Who do you think was the most dramatic? Ooh. Um, the most dramatic? I think it would be me <laughs> <laughs> because... I mean, as Kelly, I had to do so many dramatic, crazy things. You know, she got burned and shot and all, all kinds of things happened to Kelly. I, I always felt bad for you. Okay, who was yes. the biggest flirt? <laughs> the biggest flirt, well, that would be a tie between all of the boys. Oh. Um, I think, I, you know, any given day, it could be Luke, it could have been Jason, it could have been Ian, it could have been Brian, you never know. All the boys. And finally, who was the cutest couple that never was? Ooh. Interesting. Cutest couple that never was. I would have to go with, uh, well, I'm very early into the show right now, and Brenda and Dylan are hot and heavy. Uh-huh. And so I think they were a pretty cute couple until Agreed. Kelly came in and ruined everything. You ruined it. You ruined it. <laughs> <laughs> I love, listen, I'm such a big fan of 90210. I, know, I loved, I loved I never it. missed an episode. I played college football. I have to tell you a quick story. And it was Wednesdays, and people were like, Jeff, what are you doing? I'm like, I'm going to watch 90210. And they're like, Pff. By the end of the season, <laughs> the whole team was in my room watching 90210. They were all pretending like they didn't watch. They watched. But, anyways, let's get. I love that. <laughs> I hear that a lot. <laughs> yeah, right there. I don't know why. It's a great show. All right. You're a mother, you're an actress, obviously. <laughs> One thing people may not know is that you are a master baker. Mm. I said baker. Tell us about <laughs> this passion of yours. I don't know. I just, I grew up in the Midwest and I love baking. Um, it's something that I've always done. I bake cakes, pies. If it's your birthday, you're definitely getting a baked thing from me. Um, and if it's Christmas, we always pass out baked items. But it's just a tradition from my Midwestern roots that I've now passed down to my children and Baking is just something we do. I love that. How wholesome. I know, very wholesome. Okay, so uh, <laughs> confession, your co-star Cam Matheson is a, is a really good friend of our show, okay? He revealed to us that you guys have worked together four times, but that you have a terrible memory, <laughs> and that he doesn't do. think that you can name all of the projects that you worked on together. So it's time to redeem yourself, okay? <laughs> so name the four okay. times you and Cam have worked together. Okay, well, I know Dancing with the Stars. Oh, I'm gonna win because he just told me this like two months ago and my memory's not that bad. <laughs> Dancing with the Stars, yep. um, What I Like About You, yep. and uh, Secret Santa, Christmas movie from a few years ago. I don't even know how many. And now this movie, mm. A Kind Hearted Christmas. Mm. I believe that movie, Secret Santa, is actually called Holidays, unless we got it wrong. Oh, shoot. Oh, <laughs> You're right. Yeah. 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 
I'm giving her. I'm giving her the win on that one because we put her on the spot. You're not going to give her the win. I give her the win on that one. You get a little bit. Cam's going to have a problem with that, but okay. All right, go ahead. And maybe she just interpreted that as the how you know. So I'm with you, Jenny. All right, now. You're right though. It was holidays. I remember it well. Well, let's get to your movie. Sam loves holiday movies, as do I. I don't miss. Please, Jeff. Yeah, Jeff. Jeff, too. You have to tell us about a kind hearted Christmas. Tell us what we're going to be in for. Well, I'm glad that you too uh, love Christmas movies because I start watching them right after Halloween <laughs> and I can't stop. They're just like always on the TV in the background. But uh, so I was really excited to get the opportunity to do one this year. I hadn't done one in a few years and it just felt like a really good use of time to like bring joy and just comfort into people's mm -hmm. homes and um, something I want to watch. So this is a great movie about a woman who is trying to keep her late husband's Christmas spirit alive anonymously in her cute little town. And uh, of course that is sort of interrupted by the handsome uh, journalist um, that comes in to sort of break the story. I love it. I cannot wait. Uh, we all need this. A kind-hearted Christmas premiere is November 20th on GSA Family. We cannot wait. Thank you so much for chatting with us, Jenny. We adore you. Happy holidays. We'll Thanks, be right Jenny. back. Thanks, Thank you. Jenny. Thank you, Jenny. You too. Bye, guys. Thank you.